I have all these notes in here and I want to quantize them. Click out here, Command A, there we go. And if I hit Q, you guys can see that they're going to move over. Okay, because they're going to fall exactly in time with the grid lines. I mean, that's great to be perfect in music, but no one really plays perfect in music. We need to have that, the human factor. I'm not a big fan of quantize, to be quite honest with you. And I am not a big, if I do use quantizing, I don't. I set the, the strength to be small. In other words, it just slightly moves them over. So they're not perfect, okay? But for this example, I am going to make them perfect because I want to show you guys what Q quantize does okay so i want to take a look at it and you see the notes they're all starting right exactly on bar 25 you see that all of them are doing that okay if i go up here you guys can see as well that is happening as well to here right so that means that we had this robotic keyword player come in and play those chords exactly at the same time all those notes that he hit in the chord started exactly at the same time let's be real no one plays like that right so this Q um quantize that we're going to do is not available in the piano row okay it is available here on the side right so this is a region that we've selected open up the region parameter for it i'm going to open the more tab down here and you guys are going to see here that it has the Q flam okay i'm gonna click on that and i am going to select 20 ticks late okay and now let's open up that region again and let's take a look at what's going on you see what it's doing what it's actually doing is it's making all those notes in the chord is moving their location for all of them individually. So all of them don't start at the same time. What does that do? It gives it a more of a human factor. Okay. And you can go in there and move them a little bit more if you want to, right? Okay. So now let's play it. So that's what Q flam means. It means taking a chord that someone would actually play instead of all the notes starting exactly at the same time, it makes the notes shift over a little bit later or earlier, depending on which version you use, right? So here you have, if you click on here, you can select how many ticks you want and so forth. And if you want to type your own, you can type your own as well. Okay, so that's a cool um, feature to use, especially if you want to make your music sound less robotic, less stiff, just more of a human factor. And that is known as Q-Flam, the quantize. You could even